No messing around today. No ad. Oh, well, I, lucky you, Search. Lucky you. It said the advert. Well, probably you'll get an, uh, an advert, like, randomly. So we'll start anyway. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, Search. Good evening, Jen. Or oh, good morning, Jen, I should say. Hope you're well. Not skiving, playing, no man. No, well, no, no. What's it called? Yeah, there's the advert break. <laughs> there's the ad break, Serge. You spoke too soon. Uh, no Man's Sky, that's what it's called. Not skiving doing that to Dale and Jen. I hope everybody is all right. I have no clue than Serge. That's probably why I'm making no ad, no ad revenue. All right, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> Yes, he's doing it for the drops. It would have been quite handy because I, because I've, I got a chunk of a, lo a load of drops through through watching Jen, and I have no inclination to download it and play it or whatever. Can you got Jen? Are you using the mod chat view? Because that's what I have to do. I have to go into the. Not the normal the internet thingy. Game. You tried with a mod, mod chat as well? All right, fair enough. Mm. Weird. Good evening, Andrew. How are you doing? There's probably going to be a few notifications coming out. A sword day! A red day! And the sun rises! How's Andrew today? Hope you're well. I haven't sorted your mug out yet, by the way. I need to do that before the end of the week. I'm so a distracted at the moment. Too much going on. Too much going on and not enough time to do it all in. Hello, cat. Here we go. Would you mind shutting the door behind you? A sword day! A red day! And the sun rises! Bloody disruptive animals. And hello, cat. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, the yeah, the subscribe the subscriptions. I don't know why it just why it catches up. Just don't play them at the end of the day. Good afternoon, Peter. How are you? You've lost your biscuits. That does not sound good, Andrew. A sword day, a red day, and the sun. Can you imagine if like a thousand people followed us and we'd have to sit through this? Because I can't seem to get past it. Right, I think there was the, I think there's one left to go. It's worse than not, not good. Oh, that doesn't sound good. That does not sound good, Andrew. A sword day, a red day, and the sun yeah, it's it's you it's YouTube subs. I I've lost like twenty, but gained like ten. So. Swings and roundabouts, swings and roundabouts. Right then, everybody, we are again, we are live on two channels. We are live on Twitch, obviously, but I'm doing the vertical, which hopefully is working. And we are doing the, um, you need sugar. Get them, get something into you then, Andrew. Um, but we're using the, ver yeah, we're doing the vertical and the normal horizontal stream for YouTube. You've lost three today. I think I've gained four, three today, but I lost a chunk yesterday. No idea why. So I don't know if it's cleaning out bots or everybody's sick of me or what, or everybody's sick of YouTube. I don't know. I'm sure everybody's sick of all the notifications I send out. I was saying to Jen the other day, I think I over... I, I always think I over-advertise over -advertise myself. Just as I didn't. I don't, so... Hey-ho, you never know. Why am I always so far over there? Let's go that way. Not so, not so centred. That's for the vertical people. Ah... <sighs> Thank you very much, Jen, anyway. Um, but no, um, 
I do feel like, well, especially tonight when, thing is, especially if you're on Discord as well, because when I'm setting up the streams, I wish it would do it when it was actual, when it actually went live and not when you set the stream up. So there's a notification, like two notifications for YouTube and then another one for Twitch when it goes live. So it's a bit annoying. And I forgot I didn't do my usual pre preamble will be live shortly. My, my YouTube feed at the minute, Serge, is all over the place. I don't know what I've been doing. I don't know whether it's picking up random stuff that I've been watching on TikTok or what. But my, my, my usual YouTube feed used to be quite curated. Now it's just a mess. I've got a bloody clue. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, this, that, that, I mean, that's why, that's why I, I almost probably prioritise Discord a bit too much, to be honest, because there's only like, was that 50 people in the Discord? I can't remember. Maybe it's more than, no, there'll be more than that. Um, I need to, and then again, like on about advertising, Jen, I've never really advertised the fact that I have a Discord. Um, no, like put it on the main social channels for people to... Oh, no, I did the other week, didn't I? <laughs> Duh. I did it the other week. And we gained, like, three people. Oh. But Discord is very niche. I must say. That is not good scheduling. Timetabling that, Andrew, to be honest. Doing it for... Uh, Have I? Why, do I? why? Why does it do that? Bear with, bear with. Because I made. I thought I keep on switching these things off. Because there's a larger version. Because Surge couldn't read it. Botrix chat. That's the big one. Where's the little one then? Ticker. chat that's that one there we are that should be better is that better yeah sorry about that we made a bigger one so so we could read it but for some reason every time i turn it off it comes back again You know, you're edit, you editing down your stream, Jen. That is extremely brave of you. I could not be bothered. <laughs> I can't even be bothered to trim these down. And these are like an hour, like an hour and a half. But Jen, did you did you see? Because oh, I know you subscribe to it as well. But Opus Clip, I've updated to version three. Um, so it's got more more things. More abilities or something. I haven't tried it yet, but could be good. Could be good. <laughs> Skip those parts for the offline. It's actually, that's something I was going to mention, everybody. I saw a TikTok this morning, and I can't remember what the guy's name was. He was an he was an Aussie, and he was on about him and his mates send a video to each. Like it must be like to a group of them. Every, every, each Wednesday, you know, just assessing the... Well, I'm saying assessing the... Letting the mates know what they've been doing over the previous week or whatever. And they call it Waffle Wednesday or Wednesday Waffle, something like that. And I was like, ooh, that's a good idea. Maybe that's something I could do for uh, for the Patreon or the memberships anyway. So I might... Do, I, I, haven't, I really haven't got time tomorrow. I've got so much on tomorrow. It's unreal. But possibly next week. Yeah, there was not no. I, know, I was going to say, Jen, I got an email the other day, but you, your email is probably ridiculously full. Um, so I did. I did spot it. It's just my email is very quiet at the minute. Actually, oh god, I've just remembered I was meant to do something this afternoon. And I didn't. Hey ho. Um,
so yes so there's a membership thing i was thinking i might do that i like just a you know one take to the phone just have a wee chat for the membership of what's going on what i've got coming up what i've been doing a bit of behind the scenes thoughts and things like that so i might do that but like i say it'll probably not be tomorrow because i'm ridiculously busy but it's the kind of thing I can just like put in behind the membership wall. Because I'm like, I started last year with the, you know, doing the weekly videos, didn't I? And that was a lot of effort to chop, to remember to take stuff with the phone, start to start off with. So I think I finished with the trip to Scotland, didn't I? And that was, that's nearly a year ago, year ago already. Uh, What's Opus, Opus Clip is AI produced clips from your video. It's it, to be honest, I, th I think as it gets better, it's going to be really useful. So I've used it a few times and produced a few videos with it, Surge, and it works works really well. I do like it. So that'll be, you know, so they're adding more and more capability to it. So I'm. I haven't, I haven't yet to dabble with it this week. But if I do enough chatting in this next few minutes, then I'll have a bit of, a bit of something to push into it and see what it'll spit out with updated algorithms and stuff. <coughs> that does not sound good, Andrew. Oh, I bet it works really well for that, Jen. I've tried it on mine, and it's been okay. I haven't tried it for a few weeks. I haven't put anything in for the last few weeks. Because I feel like I haven't really said anything of any note that would be of any interest. But for me, it always, I, always, I always laugh at the titles it creates. Like, use this as the title for the social media. I'm like, what a load of crap. Typically all hyped up about nothing. Doesn't suit my dim diminutive, whatever you want to call it. So. Yes, and the other thing is, everybody, while still remember, yes, it was so long ago, Jen. That's That must be like more than a month ago now. It was early January, yes. There's me sitting over there, sitting there every Sunday evening. Where's It's like she's not doing a one again. She's abandoned it. Then in the afternoon it's like, why is Jen streaming games on a Friday? <laughs> like the sky <Skyping> bugger. <laughs> Uh, all good fun. But yes, I was going to say, this Friday is, yes, and a Monday. But did, did I hear right that you guys have a holiday yesterday or something? Some random made-up holiday? Or did I hear that wrong? You've got ten feathers, Serge. So, President's Day. Like I say, made up holiday. Yeah, I heard something about like there was a load of people off yesterday. But again, I got dist distracted again. Um, Friday will be the um, were were you were Zoom thing. Nighttime in the tavern. That's what it's called. So this Friday, if you are a YouTube member or if you are a Patreon supporter, I was going to say, or, or a Twitch sub. <laughs> or a Twitch sub, but there's only Jen. Um, then then you get it. Well, and I think we'll have to define it. You can, be, you can come along if you are a Twitch sub, if your Discord is connected. Because I will put... Because I will put... Um, I will put the link into the 
membership only channel on Discord. So it's easier for you all to find it. And I don't get Peter emailing us. Where's the where's the link? I've lost it. And then he's like, and then he'll be like, where is it in the Discord? <laughs> What do you mean, really, Jen? Yes, you, you are the only Twitch sub at the moment. Yeah, I've only, I've only got 79 followers. Oh, competing Zoom things. Not yet, Peter, not yet. There will be probably sometime on Thursday but it will be it will Peter it will be linked in a number of places it will I don't usually email would it you like you. a cup of tea water it's not the alcoholic one anyway Jen thank you good thank you for the hydration thank you for the water which is orange juice today Keep me hydrated instead. Um, you don't wear feathers when you watch Twitch stuff. Yes, the the feathers surge are only on Twitch, which will allow you to redeem for things. Because you've been watching on Twitch for a bit now, Serge. So your 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 stash should be building. So that's one of the good good things to watch on Twitch for. Is you get you get to play with you got four not net not already search you've been you've been doing well. I need to make more things for the channel point redemptions. Tells you the stuff you can buy with it exactly. I well, think you see you can you can you can tell me to drink water. I should have a stretch thing on there as well. But if you build up sixty nine thousand, then you become a VIP for a month, providing I have enough VIP holes. I was so tempted last night, Jen, to be honest. When I was when I, I was like, oh no, what, oh no, what channel points Jen's got? And I was like, "Ooh, there's one where," and I have enough channel points. I was so tempted, so very, very tempted. Yeah, stretch is a good one. Oh, oh yeah, it's a good fun. Good fun. Right. Uh, what was I going to do? I can't remember. Yeah, it is. As long as you're not in a stressful game. Um, it is, Serge, it is, you, you can suggest, suggest to me, like, a, like a way you can, a way, a way for me to edit my image. I didn't really think that one through, to be honest. The thing is, you can be cashed in, I can still ignore you. <laughs> That's the thing. That's the thing. Mm. All right. So I better get on. So tonight, beyond, beyond all the waffling, um, we're going to look at some images. I saw. The thing is, the annoying thing is, I saw a really series this afternoon when I was kind of plotting out what I was going to do tonight, and I can't find it. So what looked attractive this afternoon does not look attractive now because I can't think of what it looked like. So we're going back to January last year. From when I went to Durham with Andrew and we shot Durham Cathedral. Beer goggles. Not beer goggles on, the, on, a, on a Tuesday afternoon, Andrew. I think it was, I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. Because I was like, oh, that one will be a good good one to use. 
And then it was just like, I'm scrolling through the, all the pictures now and I'm like, I have no idea where they are. Where they are, what they are. Madness. So, um, yeah, so that idea has kind of gone out the window. Might have been these ones. If I switch over, I think this may have been one of them. Because I, uh, I thought, well, what, I, what I'm thinking, what I'm thinking of doing tonight is using one of the one of these where the sun isn't really hitting it, but do something a bit different with it, and like process it and then invert it. So the darks become light and the lights become dark uh, and then go a little bit abstract with it all. It's kind of confusing me because it's got these, some of these were done multiple, you know, multiple exposures in camera. It's all kind of screwed up a bit. So I might not do this particular set. What I think I might do is go to the good set at the end. <laughs> when the sun came out, and it was very, very much easier to get a result. So, so it's kind of like these. But maybe use a set that I haven't actually used yet. Actually use a set that I haven't even decided were good enough to use. That's always a good challenge. Uh, so let's go with that. Uh, 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 see which ones are these. Completely different angle, to be honest. Take that one off. Take that one off because it's too. So it was, it was a bit of a challenge to use rejected ones, ones that I initially thought went, there was nothing to them. Um, so I might find when I try to put them together, there's still not much, not much to them. better on screen. Uh, right, so. So if you're watching on the vertical stream, then um, you'll be able to see the main gist of the image at the top. Now I've got the right this right hand panel down below so you can kind of see what adjustments I'm making. If you look closely enough, obviously. Corrections. Button presses. Not put in yet. So I might kind of do two. I was going to say two versions of this. Probably go down the tradition, more like my traditional route. And um, process in my normal way. And then I think I might do an inverted one and go a little bit mad with it. that we'll just give that preset and uh, a bit in yellow not too much though Just a tad. I'm still alive, aren't I? I'm going to bring the shadows down a bit because if I do decide to, because normally I try to open them up a bit, if I am going to, I mean, shut that bloody dog up. Um. Usually, but if I'm going to invert it, invert it, I need an area of lighter, lighter, lighter areas. 
to invert for them dark areas to become light if you know what if, if yeah i'm getting myself muddled Not much. Little tweaks. Brightness up a bit. Raise the color and the vibrance a little. Otherwise, it's going to get out of control very quickly. Little spot. Yes. That and that. Hi Ray, how are you doing? Hope you're good, man. How was life over the pond this week? There we go. Chat is missing off the screen. I think I might need to do something different with the chat whilst on the screen. So I was watching Maples, and his is like a line that, you know, well, no, one, no, it wasn't. It was on the side. Somebody's always watching, has, has it a lot, just running in a line. So I could potentially replace the scroll at the bottom. My bad. Booking shoots and buying prints. Exciting. Joys of being a photographer. Am I going to need anything else? I don't know. No, I don't think so. All right, okay. So let's sync those settings across. Hopefully they're all fine and dandy, and then we will uh, open those into Photoshop. It'll take a while, so we'll switch back. Whilst that runs, some somebody's chat on like on screen chat rate that I watched the other day. I can't remember who it was. Um, so instead of taking out, you know, a, a chunk of text. A chunk of text on screen like here it was just like a line above like a set area on the screen and I thought that was quite good and it's not invasive but people can still see it so I might look into that just as an idea We'll see. Oh, you've got that rate. Ah, very good. This must, I think I know who it was. It was um, Nicholas. German Nicholas. Nicholas. I can't remember what his surname, what his surname is. His stream. I, I looked in on his stream and he had it running across the top. That's a very good idea. quite quickly which is nice um, so blending wise you know whether we go with something a little bit different or soft light is a few potentials there Obviously, multiply being the main one, probably. So let's unuse all that. It's a good position, to be honest. So it's not this. Let's use the move tool. For some reason, I've lost all my mouse sensitivity settings because I caught a button on the mouse. So everything is now all. It's all to cock, and everything's 
too fast up. Uh, nothing doing anything. Um, and it's all really annoying. Because <laughs> the mouse now flies across the screen. That's one kind of blend and edit. So I'm just going to look at soft light here. That's very much like my previous edit, isn't it? Very nice. We're looking for something a little bit different today. because I'm going to have to kind of do what I want. Um, what I want, I'm going to have to kind of revert all the way back to this position. And I don't want to remake the entire world. Hmm, let me think. Yeah, but my, no, no, actually, we can, probably, we can probably get away with this. That's fine. Right, okay, so... Just basically start masking off this dark area just to reduce the strength of it. Because we're using the multiply blend mode. So we need a mask and we're just going to use a gradient fill. Like so. And just take that over there. That's a bit. Seems a bit on the strong side, but it's alright. It'll do. What line is that? That oh, that is that line. We want a mask on there as well. like the contrast in there. That's pretty good. So what I could do is like mask this part area this area back so it's not as harsh. So we've opened this area out and we've got a bit of the, the weir in the water. So which layer is that? That line, okay. Well, yeah, we can get rid of that. So that's multiply, so that's fine. So we can. There we go. So we've got rid of that line. We've got a bit, a bit more bigger canvas. That's good. How's the stream doing, everybody? By the way, is it doing okay? I've got a bit of a warning on YouTube. Well, that might just be because I'm using using Photoshop. Yeah, 
this one. I think I might just drop a mask on that one. Well, okay, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, Andrew. Thank you, Serge. So, just making sure you're all alive out there. <laughs> no, no, I, I, you, I was throwing up a... OBS was warning me of some kind of error. Just checking, basically. Well, then again, I can paint it back in, Connor. Just lighten it up a bit. To be honest, I can do a bit of lightning with curves and stuff. All right, really, Jen. I mean, the, the bits that I watched, it was all coming through fine, so. And this, to be honest, this usually, do, if I'm doing anything in Lightroom, it usually throws up errors anyway. So that's probably why it jerks around a lot at that time, that, those kind of times. Right, okay, so in here I want to paint in some white. Just to bring a little bit more contrast just in this area. That worked quite nicely and... using 35% opacity. Sometimes it opens up. Not really. It doesn't really matter though. It gives you that kind of classical kind of colorization in it. Not colorization. Classical painterly British master photography. Not photography. Painter and stuff. If you know what I mean. Um... Concern I've got. It's not really a concern. It's just this. You know, you've got the, the line here, you've got a bit of sky, and then you got that line there. That's the only bit that's kind of concerning me, but it's not really concerning me that much. So I think we're all right, really. Uh, I'm wondering, we've got this area here. Is that, what layer is that on? Not that one. Not that one. Not that one. What layer is it on? That's on that one. Okay. Uh, <laughs> it's in there. Then it leaves a bright spot. God damn you. So, what we need to do, I think, is... The old, um... Not the old, because it's new-ish. Is, um, Generative Phil. Generative Bob. See what it does for us. God damn, that's awful. <laughs> that is terrible. That's terrible as well. Just the edge. Why is the edge just so apparent? It's even got a 10 pixel feather. Really? Jesus. Right, okay, let's try and soften this. So which one's the best, to be honest? Where's my options gone? So if we go paint the other way on, there it is. Yeah. <laughs> I 
I know, Peter. I know. But we have new technology to help. There we are. Drop the opacity a little bit as well. Doesn't need to be precise. There's a bit of a bright spot there anyway, so that, that's fine. Oh yes, I could use blend if, but nah. <laughs> we will always resist, Peter. It's only because I can't use it to the best of my abilities. this nice lighting in here. Oh, we're back to excellent connection now. Uh, okay, so that idea of one. Adjust this. I always wondered what these buttons do. Don't trust new technology like that. Very small margins there. Very small. Uh, okay. Anything else I can do before we're going to I could lighten that a bit more by taking a whole chunk of that layer out. So it would give a lot more definition to the to the top of the towers. Um, mask. If I do that. That improves things a bit, doesn't it? Yeah, that just leaves in that leaves that bit in there. That improves the, the definition of the towers. What was the other one that was... I think that makes a hell of a difference now. Yeah. Much better, much better. Okay. So, we are now in this position, which I think looks pretty canny. Pretty canny. Um, which was the one I just adjusted? Was it that one? No, that one. What I could do is just paint in a little bit back into there. Whatever it is, one of the two. Which the strength on there. Again, that's what I want to do. Just gives it a little bit more oomph on that kind of side of the 
towers. There we are. Uh, better. Up here. Okay, so that's pretty much our starting point. Do that, and then um, I'm going to duplicate that layer as well. So this is the one I want to invert. I'm not going to do this again. Clear. Edit. That's what. <laughs> I've only been using this software for like 25 years. That's the one I want. Control and I. Invert the whole damn shebang. Uh, okay, so, and obviously now we want to do the, um, so what I want to do, I'm going to, it's already two gig, that's a lot. Um, put these in a group, kind of hide them away. So I'll just have that, one, that layer left. So if need be, I can delete the whole lot. Practically new to Photoshop after 25 years. It's, yeah, I've been using it for far too long. So curve and let's So it should make this red. It's too pink. It's too pink. Um, No worries at all, Red. No worries at all. Everybody is more than welcome to be lurk, to lurk. No worries at all. If you want us to read, a lot of the time I'll I'll go into streams and I'll and I'll be very, I'll just be lurking in the background and not quite often not even say hi. Or maybe all you'll get to is get out of us is hi, and then I'll go silent for the rest of the stream. So, but then again, I'm not a chatty person in real life either. So. This is this is my chatty time of the week. A Tuesday night and everything else is uh silence. <laughs> uh, adjustments. Small image saturation. Yeah, I think it, 
it's quite often like that where it's like whenever I look at like how many people are actually you know watching and then it's like nobody's said anything for like half an hour <laughs> it's like I know how many people are watching on YouTube at the minute when was the last YouTube comment an age ago well a good few minutes anyway To be honest, Serge, I have no idea <laughs> where this is going either. I know where I would like it to go, but whether we'll get there or not is another matter. Um, Um, oh, just oh, just OBS, Ray. There's a, there's a plug-in. I can't remember what it's called. Multiple output or something like that. It's quite. It certainly is, Andrew. <laughs> is the is the background music still on there, Peter? I can't hear it. Um, yeah, are you some multi-stream plug-in? Uh, and for the vertical, I use the ATM vertical. Thing, so I use the I use the vertical for the vertical stream that's going to YouTube, because on YouTube I've got the vertical, the horizontal, and then on Twitch I've got the horizontal, you know, like normal horizontal stream. I have to do something with this layer, uh, exactly. Um, so it's like two plugins that are running actually, Ray. So it's a so like. So I'm streaming to YouTube, and then another plugin is streaming to Twitch, and then the v the ATM vertical plugin is streaming of like a different a different encode to to YouTube for the vertical stream. So it's overly complicated, <laughs> um, but pr it is probably the easiest way of doing it without actually paying mon paying money to re to restream. So I'm all about doing for doing it for nothing. Right, what am I going to do? All right, I'm going to put this version through Analog Effects Pro. Just to kind of see where we've got, because I would like to go very dark with this. Oh, nice. Yeah. I mean, I've, we've, we've had fiber for quite a while, but just, well, Back end of the year, went up to 500, 500 meg fiber. So I think I'd been, I'd be on like, excuse me, 75 before then. And it was fine. Still no fiber. We've had, we've had fiber. For all we're in the, out in the middle of nowhere. Um, we, uh, we, you know, we're, we, we've been very well served for quite a while we were like went from like dial up to like really slow broadband uh and well, we're on that for years and then for, and then all of a sudden we got almost bypassed decent you know decent broadband and went straight to fiber great stuff All right, nice, Andrew, nice. It's as bad as that, is it? Um, but yeah, the, I mean, well, to be honest, because yesterday I tried to play, do like my, li my laptop had me Canon M50 hooked up to that to play darts with. Because, um, you know, behind us, in the, behind us in the dartboard. So there's a service out there you can play online darts. All you need is a camera fixed, you know, and pointed at your board. And for some reason, the camera decided to not no longer connect. So I had to plug in the capture device. Right, I want to go dark with this. So maybe it's this. Good. Something. 
Salut. At, uh, I was going to say, at least other things are kind of catching up, Andrew, for out in the sticks. So, like, there's there's more 4G around and and that kind of thing. Because for long enough, it was just dire. I mean, there's still plenty of places around here where there's no, there's no signal at all. Which is annoying. Because <laughs> there's plenty of places I would love to love to stream from, just using the phone. And it's just garbage. Uh, okay, so that's that. That's, that's pretty good for darkness. Just looking at other options to darken that down as well. Right. Well, I was hoping this, <laughs> this stream might be a short one, or shortish one, but it's not going to be. I think this is going to be one of these ones I just keep on coming back into Analog Vex Pro and just kind of build things up as much as I can. Right, this is about as bad as that, is it, Andrew? Sounds a bit like Craster. It's all down in a hole. And I'm sure there's still no connection down there might be by now but there wasn't for so long um, right so that's that so I'm thinking I might just duplicate this layer and scroll out yeah. do some free transform get this bugger turned right round scale right handy Want some more darkness here, and then I just play around with some blend modes. Oh. Dark, embrace the darkness. Now, one thing I wish Photoshop would do was, when you're in a state like this, is allow us just to scroll over the top of these without having to click each one when we're in the middle of a tree at transform would be lovely. Right, so if I move these kind of things around. We can go bigger. Okay, now we're gonna just a little bit of that looks not too bad actually. off because otherwise the file size get ridiculous like stupidly ridiculous 
that's there. Okay, that was a normal overlay and soft light. Yeah, we'll just leave that as a normal overlay. Right, so what we're going to do is we're going to push this version. Let me scroll in a little bit more. No, leave me alone. Don't want that. Let's scroll in so we can see how dark it is. Put this in Analog Effects Pro as well. And then we've, when we've kind of got this to a point, then we'll revert back, uh, not revert back, we'll go back and edit the, uh, the initial one, the initial more romanticized version. Instead of this dark mess. You know me. Love a bit of darkness. Love a bit of red. I believe I do believe that red is a safe word at the minute. As in, you're all right with it. Nobody's actually triggered it for a while. Starting to lose a bit of the tower there. Tower's roller. Um, the only thing is, now we're starting to look into the light and I can't see the screen properly. Yes, there is an ad search. Yes. Um, yeah, really, it's. I've, I've, like, I've, I've had mine for, a quite, for five or six years now, I think. And it's great. I mean, I wish I could do... I wish I could spend more time on it. It's one of them things that's... You know, I need to spend time on it. And I, I always feel... I'm, I mean, these guys all know that. I always feel like I need to keep on giving more all the time. It's too dark. <laughs> It's just ridiculous, Andy. Uh, is that? Laughs in Twitch too, but nice, rare. Right? To be honest, I should get that because I like I spend so much time on Twitch, and I hate having to like be sitting there waiting for gift subs to be gifted to certain certain streamers that I like. I was like, oh, bloody annoying adverts. It's quite nice, you know. I mean, you would never print this. <laughs> would you? Would you print this? It's a very minimal. Too kind, Peter. You too kind. But I do feel I, I do feel like I, I I need to be giving more. I'm just a giving person. Uh, I'm tempted to admit do like a version of this. I knock off the lens vignette. These oh no that's no that's already twit turned off that's fine. So the lens vignette. Right, so we need to position that better. Like here. So that doesn't need to be as strong. Let me bring that back into that position. Just that. Just 
10 or so. We can probably tweak it a little bit in Lightroom or whatever. It has now changed that it's no longer the representational of the cathedral. You know what? It's, I think it's one of them long-term edits which I have to work on a lot. Welcome back, Serge. Like and moving the damn thing. Okay. Right, I'm going to apply that, but I'm going to come back in separately to that. I think this is a good layer to have to work on when I've got way more time. Because I think I could get, I think I could do a lo uh, quite a lot with like painting with the Wacom and stuff like that. A Wacom tablet, however you, however you want to pronounce it. Right, so if we go back into Analytics Pro, there'd be dragons exactly, Peter. Other options down here. If you're watching on vertical, then you'll not be able to see any of these presets because it's on the other side of the screen. These ones are maybe too dark now. Kinds of works now. If I get a better color and adjust it into that position, what color are we using on there? Let's go to warm, better, much better. Don't mess with the German. Don't mess with the intelligent of the general public, Andrew. You should know that by now. <laughs> Values customers, indeed. If I go back and I go back down, there we go. There we go. little S curve, liking this area here now. So if I just tweak this a bit, can I get this over here? What I don't want is this bit splodge. This, this here, ideally I don't want it over the top of the uh, cathedral. I like this curve, but this splodge here, I don't want it here. It's very much a case of these where you move about three pixels to the left, you like it, and then you move it a little bit further, and then you don't like it. And it's like, oh, it's so frustrating. 
We could have that. Is that as big as it goes? Yes, it is. thingy priority. So over the 50%. Okay, so do I want lens vignettes? Where is that? That's actually lightening it. Okay. We want that in the middle. And we want that to be in a bit. Not to be as strong as that. Maybe it's minus six. Is that still very dark, isn't it? Are these all in the corner? Yes, right here. So contrast, where's contrast? Contrast is actually minus 17. That's why it's soft. Brightness, we want a bit of brightness come in. Yeah, that's better. Brightness. Bit of detail extraction. Then we can increase the lens vignette. Actually, we want to pull that in. Like so. See it. Could do it a little bit more. Fourteen. How's that looking? Looking all right. Yeah. Uh, okay. So we have that to that, that to that. Where's me thing? I quite like it. I mean, it's losing what it is, but we don't need it to always. Be telling us where we are. Does it? Actually, with a vignette there, it maybe does. Let's change the vignette to a rectangle. I might move things in a little bit. Mm, don't know. Be a very much more God fearing sky. I think it's going to be more, more. This is going to be another one that's going to require more tweaking after the fact, which I'm sure you all don't want to be. Because I think it definitely is something I'll do in daylight rather than night time with lights shining at me. Um, yeah, there we go. Quite like that. All settings look good. These color settings are just fine. Whatever. Well, good. I drop the strength. Increase the strength there. Maybe just drop the fade a bit. Probably one of them ones that if I did even try to print it, I would have to brighten it significantly. <laughs> Should I do that now? I've definitely gone red again, so yes, you can say that again. Right, okay. I don't, but I did purposely kind of set out on this route. Purposely, maybe on purpose. Possibly. Uh, apply. 
Do I? Yeah. Fire that. I think what I am going to do, I'm going to get rid of all those backing images. All the construction work. Because otherwise the file is going to be huge. And don't like that. Not when we're running three streams. By the way, have a, hello to everybody watching on YouTube. I can see how many people are watching. Welcome to the stream. I hope you're all well. Feel free to chat. You don't need to lurk all the time. Potentially could combine some of them together. But yeah, I think that one. That one is. I think there's there's definitely more to do with that one for sure. So watch out for that one in YouTube community chat or YouTube community page. I'm gonna basically anybody that hasn't what hasn't hasn't seen the YouTube sec the community section on YouTube. Is supposedly getting pushed more it has its own section on mobile in the mobile app so you can see all the community posts for everybody that you follow and others probably um so i'm kind of probably going to use it a bit like instagram so when i've kind of got this sorted out i will add i will post this particular version on there and probably instagram anyway Hi, Alien. Yes, we are back to red today. Very de a determined effort was made, Alien, to be to be red. Red and dark, the best, the best, the best of the best. The only way to be. Um, so, so yeah, we are, we've got this far, but I think there's there's work to do behind the scenes. I think, Alien. Um, I need dedicated time and I need to turn these lights off to be able to see what I'm doing. And we'll make a concerted effort to make this better than it already is. That's the, the, that's the aim anyway. So, so, that's those. Mean and moody. Yeah. That is life, Alien. That is life. <laughs> well, from my, from my perspective, anyway. Dark, <laughs> uh, but this week that we've had some sunshine. It hasn't been well. It, it did. It did rain for a bit, but you know, this since last Tuesday, we've had some sunshine and it's felt spring-like. Not been so miserable. Um, I think it's due to change today, like overnight and into into tomorrow. But it's been. It's been nice to have dry roads and dry pathways and uh, a blue sky and, and you can, daff daffodils are starting to come through. The snow drops off fully out. It, it, it just feel optimistic again. Yeah, exactly. I mean, it hasn't been warm, but it's been sunny and just brighter because it's been such a miserable winter of just dourness. Just dull and dreek and murky and grim <laughs> very very grim right so that's that one um right, I'm gonna put these ones into a folder as well into there. the traditional view Really? Jesus, that's much further on than, than, than we've got up here. Um, potentially, Andrew? I know it's meant to piss down tomorrow. But, I mean, Aileen probably going to get um, probably going to get snow again up there, but we haven't heard anything. We haven't had any, any hint of snow. Hi, Ramted. Welcome to the stream. 
hopefully I'm pronouncing the name right. Yeah, I I hate it. I hate I hate I hate the winter and this winter because I mean I haven't even had like bright sunny frosty freezing cold days. It's just been grim. <sighs> How are you doing, Ram? I don't think we've met yet, Ram. I don't think I've been in a stream with you in yet. But welcome to the stream. Thank you for joining. Right, one more. Lost track again. Right, so do I need any further? No, we've done brightness and stuff like that. Right, Analog Effects Pro. Used to stream, ah, very good. Why did we quit? Why did we stop streaming? I, th I thought once you started streaming, you, you couldn't stop. <laughs> I thought we were here forever. I feel like that's the case. You lurk a lot, fair enough, Ram. But anyways, welcome to the stream. Is that one of, one of them rams? Does it have a dodge in front of it, Aileen? Am I getting the right the, the, the right brand of vehicle? I must admit, cars aren't my cars aren't my forte. That is. Okay, so is this going to be one of these images where I get 27 versions and they're all good? Potentially. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure I would appreciate one as well, Aileen, even though I wouldn't really know what it was. <laughs> okay. Goddamn work getting in the way again. It's a sickener, isn't it? Bring back the... Did, did, oh, we, Ram, were you one of these people that, that streamed during the pandemic when we all had time? So many people streamed during the pandemic. Oh, if, if we could go back in time and do, do the pandemic again, we'd all be doing streaming. Happy days. Good times. Um... One of the delights of being busy, Ray. I kind of, I was going to say I kind of wish I was I was busy, but nah, I quite like me on independence, to be honest. In other words, I like doing nothing. <laughs> yeah, there's that, Jen. Oh, yeah. Swings and roundabouts. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I, 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 I streamed before the pandemic as well, but it's, I just, I do, I do kind of wish I could re, I could redo the pandemic again. Like knowing that I would not be ill and nobody around us would get ill and all this kind of stuff. It was just, it was a remarkable time and I didn't make the most of it at all. <laughs> Like all these people that did creative things in the pandemic and I'm like, you're lucky gets. I couldn't, I oh, just can't, couldn't do it. Didn't do it. <laughs> like I was either sitting around a lot or talking to the neighbors a lot. I think that's why I walk the dog so much now. He got used to going out so much. from the top there um 
nothing really too challenging about this this particular edit um it's just one of them edits you could do several excuse me several edits but they'll all look the same eventually So we have this version. I am going to come back into this and do a second version of this. Yeah, not everybody had a good time early, and that was the thing. I just know, I just know, I wish I'd been way more creative. But then again, we were all—it was all so uncertain and grim and worrisome. Uh, I mean, obviously, I, you know, I had the benefit of being out, out here in the middle of anywhere. So, I, you know, kind of, kind of, kind of enjoyed that. All right, back into Animal Effects Pro Pro. Oh, I bet, Jen. Yeah. I mean, like, I mean, like, we've got the main road going past, like, a mile away. The A1, which, you know, England and Scotland. And um, you could literally walk down the middle of it and not see your car for ages. And it was just like, so when you sat in the garden, it was just silence. You know, you, you don't usually get that until about two in the morning. So it was remarkable. Right, so I'm going to do this version, see if there's anything. Yeah, that's all right. Gets, you know, retains the uh, the... The water coming over the weir. Uh, sorry, Jen. <laughs> Probably. I apologise in advance if, if it does get a bit rumbly over there. No, no. Uh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Second exposure. That's one, two, and. Anyway, I want. Mm -hmm. oh, excuse me, people. Jeez. Bout of yawning. Right. So this is one of these occasions where you, you have one position and it works. Because you go too far, you've got this building appearing here. Um, and then you've got too much when you come across come along too far, this sky starts wiping out the top of the buildings. Yeah, I think we're all kind of a bit like that, Andrew. Like, so you, you know, you, I think we're just, we 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 all just ran on adrenaline and during it, didn't we? Oh, that was a nice surge. Positives and all that. You got you like you say you got to know her very well over that time. Thrown in at the, at the deep end. <laughs> there was no, no chance to back out and cha change because you hadn't uh, weren't allowed to do anything else. I was just pleased of where where you know where. Definitely a case of really pleased. I live where I live, and that in the in you know at that time. Actually, that bright area that looks kind of. Oh, come here then. So that goes back to zero. Comes to this over here. And brings us down. We've got a bright over here and a bit of shadow here. Just position it roughly. I think that needs to be it's 
So you've got these trees just catching the light there. So we've got that intense shot. That looks pretty nice. And obviously the water will be quite dark, but we could still bring some of that back. That's that. Take that off, that leaves that. Yeah, so really this, we can mask some of this out, partially a bit. Well, I think that looks quite nice now. I didn't think we'd get more out of this location, to be honest, but it's a fantastic location. Saves me going back. <laughs> Turns out he's quite nice. Brilliant. <laughs> Brilliant. Right, apply. There's, a, there's advantages to it all, Jen, you see. I think I've never talked to my neighbours so much. Because, like, everybody was out. <laughs> You go for you you go out for a dog walk and the you know the rules were like was it half an hour a day or something like that and I'd be out for I'd be out for like two two and a half hours just because everybody was in their gardens wanting to chat it was great times so it was good for that reinvented yourself Peter what were you before. <laughs> Uh, okay, so I want a mask. And this, I'm thinking I'm just going to paint. I'm just going to paint in these. So, a razor. I need to lock to be fatter. And the opacity down to like 25%. Yeah, 25%. Just very subtly. Uh, between the, uh, the mill and these trees. So it just keeps a little bit of contrast in there. A bit of darkness. You used to be pretty normal. I don't believe you, Peter. <laughs> I do not believe you. Right, so we want a gradient tool. That's probably a bit too much. I'm just going to drag this way off the bottom. Like so. So what's that like? Yeah. I think that's far enough. Far enough away. Subtle enough. That's that's decent, grant right. So what I actually I'm still gonna do I'm gonna, still gonna brighten the sky a bit. So curves layer. Better. That's better. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Oh, you switched over YouTube, jo um, Serge. Well done. Stay here, Lane. Sorry if you're already away. Well done, Jen. You keep reminding them. Right. So, um,. Yeah, I know it's for that version, fine. Yeah, I think so. 
Right, how big is this? 3.6. Right, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to remember what was in here. So this is all the construction stuff in here, in this group. So all that construction stuff made this base image. Uh, so to save a bit of space and about 10 minutes save time, I'm just going to dump all this in there. So it's reduced it down to 2 gigabytes. Hey. No, there isn't there isn't surge, but you get you get to have so much other fun on Twitch. You get to play with the channel points and stuff on their surge. You could potentially get me drunk on there. <laughs> right, so if I yeah. Right, this is the like this is the main version. So if I save this as is, file save should take it back to Instagram. Not Instagram. What's it called? Lightroom. Like this. And then I'll save individual versions as single layers. And try not to cock up the uh, naming. Thing, 25th of January, yep. Um, edit two. Okay. Um, reasonably quick. Chug, 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 chug. Mm -hmm. Present, right, okay. Uh, undo. So it gets all my layers back. Turn that one off. Turn that one off, turn that one on. So in here we had, oh, there's quite a lot of construction in there actually. So we had these two versions, which I'm going to return to. So I'm not gonna extract this one yet. I've just gotta remember in my head where this, <laughs> where this file is. But then again, I knew I could. And then just open it as a, with Lightroom adjustments. So this is the main version. So I'm gonna go flatten. Where's flattened gone? One eyes. <laughs> Where's it there? You got moving it. File save as three. Okay. Yes, if you're not, if you if you're watching and you're enjoying this, leave a like. On the YouTube version, anyway. I don't know if anybody's watching. I, I'll have to check the uh, stream later to see if anybody's watching on the vertical. Because we are streaming vertically on YouTube as well. Which might be an experience and a half. Um, right, block that one off. And then we'll save this one as well. My brain, work it out. <laughs> Loving the information that of their of that search. <laughs> well done. God, if we could clip chat. Wouldn't that be great? Might do that anyway, Surge. Because it appears on screen. Fantastic. Loving the honesty. Why is this one slow? Why is this save slow? Have I cocked something up here? The others flew by. This is going to like, it's only up to 60%. Did I do something wrong? Have I just lost 
an hour and a half's work. <laughs> Is it dark in the mornings or something, Jen? You don't have lights in your house. Right. Why why did that one take so long? Right, I think that's everything. So if we go back to the light room. But yeah, there we are. So that's restars. And give you three stars. Oh no, light room module, you'll be faster. Give you three stars. And give you three stars. <laughs> all right then all right then some of us just need light that's all no without, without coffee it's pitch black yeah, exactly search right so cropping of this so i think this particular one i think it's probably just going to be a well i don't know what we could do with the we could, we could have a crop for for uh, Instagram, I suppose. I was thinking just three, like just a box down to three by two, to be honest. Pretty much. Excuse me. I just want to make sure I am inside those lines where we've blended together. Like so. Let's make another version. A virtual copy, and um, let's give this a square crop. Point where the, maybe, the, maybe the water should be a little bit brighter. God, no, I thought my YouTube, I thought my my YouTube recommended feed was a bit screwed up, Andrew. <laughs> I think I've heard that before somewhere. Don't know why. But yeah, that I could be doing with a little bit brighter. But I don't know. What's... Yeah, but then um, memories need to be tighter cropped. Because that left hand side is a bit. It's a bit. There's not much going on in it. I think it needs that extension left. Um, so let us get in tight. Tight like a tiger. Like so. so we've got a bit of the weir in like that. I think that oh, it'll probably, I can still probably get a bit of brightness into there, but that requires a mask. Let's not do that until later. <laughs> Find the handy invention. <laughs> Who knew is all I can say. Right, I think this one is because it's got no foreground. I think this is core crying out for a 16 by 9 crop and will probably be a wallpaper for my membership. Is it next week, isn't it? First the first of March is next week? Is it? Oh, we've got extra days. First of March is next Friday. Jesus. It's gonna be Christmas in no time. <laughs> that looks alright. The hint of the mill at the front there. The eyes very much drawn to the uh, to the cathedral. Quite like that. Okay, so we've got. No, I'm not going to do anything with this one when it loads. So I'm going to refine this with a bit of hand painting and stuff like that. I think. So this, but this version, I think. I think there's definitely more to do on this one as well. But for the time being, I'm going to make a virtual copy. Give it a square crop. 
So it's pretty much ready for uh, Instagram. I think this one definitely lends itself to, to a square crop because we've got that leading curve in through the foreground. That's how the tower's right in the middle. So we've got that curve leading in. <laughs> Can't wait for some. I'm, wi I'm wishing the air wheel completely already. Yeah. Can't believe it's an early March. It's ridiculous. Yeah. No, but I think there's definitely more to play with in this image. So expect at some point in the future another version of this particular image. I think there's definitely something else there. But yeah. Anyways, right. So I think that will do us for this evening. Um, thank you oh so much for spending your mornings, afternoons, evening, whatever it is, uh, with me today. Uh, very much appreciate you stopping by, whether you've been here for an eight, the whole stream or just a little bit of it. Uh, Always, always appreciate it. If you would um, like to support the channel, drop, the, if you're on YouTube anyway, drop the channel, not drop the channel a subscription if you're not already. Drop the video a like. That's always helpful. No worries at all, Search. It's always a pleasure and always a pleasure to you, see you, sir. Um, so for the... Membership, everybody in the membership. There is the it's the monthly Zoom this Friday evening. I will send out links forthwith, uh, probably on Thursday uh, in time. So that'll be the links will be on Discord in the membership channel, um, Patreon, and the YouTube members membership bit in the community page. Which reminds me that I still have. Because they'll probably uh, when when did we say? Well, that's to give them away today. There should be another batch of memberships I could give away. Membership gifting—that's what it is. That's what I want. So I can gift five memberships to people in YouTube. So if you haven't already got your uh, membership acceptance thing turned on, do so. And you're in a chance of getting a membership gifted because I get 10, 10 every every month to get. So if you're in on that, then providing you check the community posts, then you will get a notification about the Zoom, and you'll be more than welcome to join us. Unless you're awkward. Sounds like the dogs want new. Shut up, man. Let them out when I'm done. <laughs> right, so I'm going to press the gifting now and see what happens. See if anybody gets any. So we've got a few random, few random people getting them. Some, I'm sure, we've never seen and never will. <laughs> Did I get any notifications there or not? Notifications coming through. Yes, no. It'll all get a bit noisy. Get out before it happens. I might be because I did it on the uh, on the vertical side of things. Maybe that's why I didn't do anything. Oh well. Right. Exactly. <laughs> I know, Jen. I know. It's not the dog making the noise. It's me bloody mother again. Where is he? Where is he? I'm like, I'm still in working. <laughs> I was like, just wait. It's only 20 past. Doesn't usually go till 10 o'clock anyway. Uh, right. So, yes. Gonna wrap, wrap up stream. Thank you all much. Again, thank you all very much for watching. If, like I say, if you want to join anywhere join the patreon that's, a, that's probably the best place to join
double chat again. I don't know, Andrew. It t keeps on turning itself back on. I'll have to. If I just actually, if I just delete it, it'll probably be better. Uh, yes. There we go. I've deleted it. Hopefully, it'll not come back. It's persistent. It bloody is. Right. Anyways, thank you all very much for watching. Paul, why are you just saying hello now? Well, goodbye now. But good to see you, man. Uh, remember, we might see you on Friday if you if you're if you're available. Hope, hopefully, you're not doing too badly with the back. Uh, but yeah, Paul's been lurking. <laughs> well, he's just coming at the end. Uh, but yeah, good to see you, Paul. Anyway, right. Hopefully, we'll see you Friday. Uh, okay, right, that'll do. Uh, I better go and walk the dog. Sounds like I need to go and spend time with him. Uh, and so we will see you. Actually, maybe I'm trying to do an extra, another stream during the like every week. So potentially Thursday for a short one. Maybe he's more chatty than arty. I don't know. We'll see. You were quiet. You were very quiet, Paul. <laughs> Good to see you, the man. Good to see you. Right, ending this now, and yeah, I'm just gonna. I bet I better run, so I'm not gonna do any raiding. But go find somebody. If you're on Twitch, go find somebody to join. Pass on the pass on the viewership. But yeah, I'm not sorting all that out now. I better rush. Anyways, right. Good to see you all. Thank you so much for watching and potentially see you Thursday. If not, I'll see the membership on Friday and then the, if I don't stream Thursday, I'll stream sometime over the weekend. Determined to do a second stream a week. So, right. Till the next one. Keep it hard. See you.